U.S. dollar pulls back slightly during the early hours on Wednesday. Before we start, a quick word from our sponsor. This video is brought to you by Xness, the world's leading retail brokerage firm offering ultra-fast execution and no overnight fees. Look for a link in the description below. The U.S. dollar has pulled back just a bit during the early hours on Wednesday against the Japanese yen as we continue to see plenty of support just below. The 140 yen level is an area that the market has bounced from recently and therefore I think we have a situation where people who continue to believe in the idea of the Bank of Japan tightening will be waiting to see whether or not the 140 yen gets closed underneath. On the other hand, if we turn around and bounce from here, we very well could see the US dollar pick up steam. The FOMC is at the end of the day on Wednesday, and it'll be interesting to see how the market behaves because, quite frankly, everybody already knows the Federal Reserve is going to be cutting rates, but some people are starting to bet on 50 basis points. Some are even calling for 75, which, of course, is ridiculous. In this environment, if the market were to bounce from here, I do think that the 145 yen level is a bit of a target. If we can break above there, then the market is likely to continue to go even higher. In general, this is a market that I think is going to continue to be very noisy, but I think you have to pay close attention to not only the Wednesday session but also the friday session as the bank of japan also has its interest rate decision and its press conference so i think the next couple of days are very noisy and while i am looking for a position to the upside i also recognize that this is probably something that you need to see how the dollar closes out the week against the yen before you really put money to work if you enjoyed the video give me a thumbs up and subscribe